Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how you can add reviews to your GoDaddy website in 2024. So today, we're going to learn how to add reviews to your GoDaddy website. Of course, reviews can significantly boost your site's credibility and even help build some uh, trust with your visitors and customers. So in this tutorial for 2024, we'll guide you through the steps to integrate reviews seamlessly into your GoDaddy website builder site. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll need to go and log into your account on GoDaddy. To do so, go and open a browser. For me here, I'm using Brave. For you, you can use whatever you want. Once you open that browser, basically go to this URL section. So go there, type godaddy.com, hit the enter button, and you'll be taken to their home screen or main screen. Once you are here, of course, if it's your first time, instead of my your account here, you'll find the sign-in option if you have an account. And if you don't have an account, you'll find the sign-up option to create a new account. You'll be able to do both with Google, Facebook, I guess, and Microsoft if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of filling up your information and creating or even logging into your account. Once you do so, you'll find yourself on this page. Specifically here, you'll be able, of course, simply to go and start doing your thing as adding reviews. So once we're logged into our account, we'll need to navigate to the Website Builder. So go here to Website, click on that, click on Website Builder. Once you do so, you'll be taken to this page. Click on Start for free. Of course, no credit card required. And here you'll find the list of the website that you have, or you'll be able to go and create a new site. I'll just choose one of those sites, as an example, like this Omex Gaming, and I'll try to go and add some reviews on it. So let me just wait until I access the site editor. How? As you can see, I'm on dashboard. So I'll go here to the left panel or right panel, and I'll click on edit website right away. But before this example, you can add a lot of things to your website, like as example, some products from here, appointments from here, a lot of things. So you can go through that before you get go into the website builder. So for me, I'll just go to edit site. So I can access the site editor. And of course, from there, I'll be able to do a lot of stuff. So once we are here, uh, as an example, just wait. So once we are here, as you can see, all I need to do is simply Go and add a new section for reviews. How to add a new section? Simply, of course, you will have to go to the page that you want. As an example, maybe you don't want it in the home page. I don't know. You maybe want it on another page. But for me, I'll just go and add it on the home page. I'll scroll down to the bottom. I'll click on add a section to add a reviews section. Here, of course, uh, you will have to add the section. And you can, of course, browse through the available sections and look for sections specifically designed for uh, testimonials or reviews. You can select the reviews section to add this to your page. As an example, you can simply just type here reviews. And as you can see, the play, uh, displayed reviews that's automatically connect from an external site or select like uh, some reviews to add on your own, as an example. So I'll just go and click on add that. And this section should be added. So let me just wait. As you can see, so player testimonials, uh, the ultimate proof. Of course, you can change that as an example. Just type reviews here as an example. Now, to show reviews on your site, connect your account as an example to Facebook. If you're trying to connect it, or if you have your uh, reviews on Facebook, if you have it on Google My Business, make sure to connect into that. If you have it on Yelp, make sure to connect into that. If you have it on YouTube, make sure to connect into that. If you want to add reviews manually, just check that option and simply, change whatever you want, like the title or the name of that guy's example, let's say uh, his name is Omix. The review is an example. I have, or I don't know, I love this product. As an example, it is so great. Uh, I don't know, it helps me so much. As an example, of course, other than that, make sure to add the photo for the guy. Of course, where you will get this review is make sure to not fake it. Because like if you fake it, it's probably going to be obvious. Uh, so make sure to not fake it. Make sure if it's real persons or if you have another store, for example, on Etsy or on Amazon, make sure to get their picture, add their picture here. And of course, for me as an example, just go here to photo and click on add the random photo here that I have. I'll just go and add this photo as an example and click on insert. And let's say this is the guy who reviewed. Of course, I can make the picture bigger so it look good or something like that. I don't know, depending on whatever you want. Then click on done. You can make it black and white. Then, of course, the rating. Put the rating that they put. Make sure to not fake it, as I said. 
an example let's say like that uh, review name reviewer name okay so that's the name so an example here i'll just put omics and here on the title i don't know just put this so you can let the title empty. oh sorry i clicked on f12 i guess so, so you can even let the title empty and just make the review the picture and the name of the person you can change of course the dates like for example maybe he purchased this products and the 5th of may as example so 5th 5th uh, of course 5 5 2024 and yeah that's going to be for this review of course you can go to the second review third review you can add up to nine reviews if you want to add this manually if you want to connect it to an external source you'll be able to add a lot and you can even change the background page however you want as an example so if we go here to a uh, background page i'll just click on change image you can look for the page uh, or for the images that you want or even add the image from your own pc as example i'll just add this image so i'll just wait for it until it's uploaded once it's uploaded as an example so let me just wait for here so as you can see once it's added i'll just click on insert and once you do so as you can see the background will be changed as simple as that so of course I'll just go back here to website and of course or i'll go to specifically that section of course i'll just go back to add menus uh, or reviews manually of course for this i'll just go and delete this review because i don't want to fail them all and i'll let one review as an example of course make sure for you to add as many as possible of course if you add like too many as an example so let me just show you how if you add like too many click on done click on add done add done to show you as an example if it's more than three or more than four how it's going to show so as example we have here i guess five so one two three four five six okay so six so as you can see how people were going to browse through the others simply click in here and they will be able to be taken to the other reviews or here as you can see so we have two options to go through the other reviews so just click on that and you will be able to of course like that's not working but if i click on preview so let me just go down here so if people click in here as you can see they'll be taken to another uh, things so don't worry if it's not working in the sites make sure it's work it's working in on preview so yeah make sure to change whatever you want you can even choose uh, other things like the title for that so as you said for me I, I add reviews there and yeah once you're done preview everything and see if everything is working as intended make sure to save your changes and publish it and you'll be good to go so that's gonna be it for me today thank you for watching and goodbye